So one of the coolest things about this game is that um, you can literally uh, play this game in a couple different ways. Um, so in my playthrough, for example, I killed Jessica and Chris and Ashley, and then I accidentally blew up Emily and Mike at the very end. I'm not going to say how or how these things happen. Uh, for you guys that have played the game, you know how. For you guys that haven't, you'll see how. So, um, but yeah, we'll get to see how Junior's thoughts are on the games and uh, what he thinks of the game so far as, as the game progresses. The game's awesome. So, like, she just fed this squirrel. Yeah. Okay. That bird flying away, that totem pole was trying to tell you let the bird fly away. Okay. That, that comes into effect later. But I'm not kidding, if you fuck with the animals too much, some of them can kill you. And there's a way in this game that everyone can survive, and there's a way that everyone can also die. Oh, I fucked it up and already. then there's different combinations of everything in between. All the way up here. The pass is beyond our control. The only thing you really have to like have a good eye for is those totem poles because sometimes they're gonna be kind of hard to see on the ground. Okay. And they don't always glow. Awesome. Bags here. Where are you? You're not in the bag, are you? Hello. She's not very funny. What do we have here? You think so? Yeah, man. I'm always surprised at how great this game is. So close the bag or look at the phone. Maybe I should have Good guy Mike over here. Yep. Fucking Junior Chris. killing them with Sam. kindness. Hey, you made it. Chris. I'm not gonna lie, I don't like this guy. I don't like the way he looks. Methodical, protective, humorous. Like to me, he just tries too hard to be funny. Dude, look at the graphics around his coat though. Oh like the top so part? Yeah. I found something kind of amazing. What? I'm not going to tell you. You got to see for yourself. Come on, it's this way. Where? Right around here. It's going to blow your mind. Bro, what do you think of the game so far, like 30 minutes in? I hate that I killed those two girls. I want to <laughs> save all of them. Oh, I want it, look at this. So, nice. Milgram Victor. Mayo 6-2, he was last seen in the Where You're Gonna Be. Once in connection with first degree oh, arson offense, so he burned here. something of various up death threats. Anyone with information regarding this dangerous criminal should contact the Black... I don't know what BPMC is, to be honest. It's just oh, down there. Down there. The Blackwood Provisional Mounted Constabulary. Good try. Thank you. An attempt right. was made. So yeah, that it, could be our killer right there. Oh, you feeble. Feeble, feeble, uneducated, naive man. Oh, Junior. I'm gonna let you figure out the clues on now. Blaze the killer. Ta da! Pretty I'll, red, I'll let you right? know some few things. Um, yeah. Don't fuck with the animals. Come on, look at these beauties. Uh, and by that, I kind of mean just don't kill them. Who would? Even here. You know, trust me, the options will be there. The Just don't the kill the animals. Doing at the base oh. of the ski lodge. Uh, dude, have you ever met Josh's dad? And then yeah. also, um, he's like Grizzly Adams or something. So everything I'm you can to... interact with kind of glows a little bit. Ahead, there's like All two. Right. There's like ten. There's like over a hundred of those in the game of the little glowing things. Yeah. Maybe over two hundred. I'm not gonna lie though. There's three that you do not want to do. One of them you might know when you see it. The other two are kind of really difficult to know, I think, I think unless you've passed the game once or twice. All right. But there's, yeah, but there's like two or three of those, like, little intractables that will fuck you over. But most of them are good. Almost, like, like 99% of them are good. Wow. It's just like this, nice. these, like, two or three. All right. I'm bad. And I don't know at least one. I'm bad at. I'm gonna go yeah. ahead and There's one that for sure is terrible. Nah, I don't think You'll so, know no. when you see it. Okay. Well, anybody and their brother could shoot a bottle that big, that close. Putting uh, your military training to use, I see. Yep. 
See what I mean about the animals? Yeah. Like, it, the game will give you a choice to kill them if you want to. Nice shot. That's me. Your ass just got sacked. <sighs> Hey, sharpshooter, a ride's coming. Wait, I'm just getting the hang of this. Come on, Chris, the cable car. Dude, I haven't had a monster in such a long time. It mm -hmm. tastes really good. I can't have them. Hmm? So I can't have them no more. They make me nauseous. Really? It's crazy. Yeah. That's because I drank so much. It's definitely really? weird coming back up here. That now, like, year. I can only have one yeah, every once in a while. Now, I usually get myself like a big coffee or a monster whenever I do these let's plays. Yeah. Because I don't like eating yeah, through weird. them. Doors locked. So yeah. Uh, or or like if I can a smoothie, but the problem with smoothies wow. is that, that they make me really thirsty. I, like they I make know. me because it's yogurt and it's a whole bunch of fruit and both those things are sweet. That's delicious. Yeah, they are good. Though. Um, best smoothie place is Jamba Juice. Yeah. For you. I hate that there's only a few of them out there. All right, so now you're using uh, Chris. What a crazy place to set up house. No matter how rich you are. So That's hotel and sanatorium. Think about that for a second. Mountain. It's a hotel and also an, a mental institution. That's a, I didn't know what that word meant. So. Oh. A sanatorium is a mental institution. I thought the car was closer. Guess we gotta wait. I'm trying to get the appeal of killing time at the shooting range. How long is this gonna There was take? footage of the hot tub for some reason. It's a big mountain. It's still it's beautiful. Yeah. Some Z's, but... Yeah, he tries too hard to be funny. I'm just like going to the prom. Here we go. Right. Adventure begins. Her, uh, Sam, she's my favorite. The right thing to do. Who's that? The girl that you, know, you were using earlier. Yeah. Everyone so. Sam, the she's my favorite one to use. I mean, Josh seemed really pumped about us all. She a badass? Something, didn't he? Yeah. Um, no, I, he she just seems did. smarter I than everybody else. I haven't seen so excited about something in forever. Good, good. Her and Mike are my two favorite characters. Mike the starts off as a douchebag. It was, it was but a good idea. Especially towards the end, there's one line that he says that won me back. We're all here, aren't we? Thanks, bro. Good talk. <laughs> Thanks, bro. <laughs> you know what? Let's just let's just stop talking about what happened and enjoy the trip. Uh, you know what, you're right. You know how Josh and I met? No. Okay. Third grade. Josh sat in the back of the room, I sat in the front. We didn't even know each other existed. But the kid sitting next to Josh started strap snapping the training bra on the girl in front of him. So the teacher made him move to the front, where I was sitting. Okay, so? So I got moved to the back. And, and to the next to Josh, that's how we met. I, mean, and I know, right? Friends. There's like to no point day, to that stuff. Yeah. Match made in heaven. If it weren't for the fact that Jeannie Simmons hit puberty like three years early and on that day decided to wear a low cut shirt that showed off her training bra, I mean, who knows? You could be riding in this cable car alone right now, or we're talking to some other person entirely. Boom. Butterfly effect. I hate that conversation. <laughs> Because to me, it's just like so beating you over the head with a hammer of the butterfly effect after they already explained it in the beginning. It's a refresher, dude. For dumb people. Hey, some people need it. Just told you. Girl. Yeah. She's irreverent. So I, don't know what that I didn't know what that word meant until I played this game. Okay. Um, it just means she kind of just doesn't care about stuff sometimes. Awesome. Carefree. Yeah, oh, carefree. Yeah, boy, oh, boy. New people. Time to meet and greet. She is Mike's new uh, girlfriend. Okay. That's the important part. Who's the old one? 
Oh, you're sister? gonna meet her. Her name was Ashley. She was that chick with the black hair in the mole. Jess, hey. Jessica, over here. Uh, are you guys having a really weird stroke? Which We're stuck in this stupid say. thing. Can you please let us out? Pretty please. Yeah, the game does these like little weird things like that. But it's oh fine, it kind of slows down the pace. God. Most of I them aren't really timed. Another 10 minutes in there and I would have chewed off my own leg. Oh, sick, Chris. Look, I got a lot of meat on my bones. It's all muscle down here. Yeah, right. Uh-huh. Hey! <laughs> well, 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 what do we have yeah, Chris! Here? My yeah, goodness! Seems that someone has a little crush on our good friend and dear class president Michael Monroe. Chris. And what kind of sizzling erotica might our Jessica be capable of imagining? I wonder. Uh -oh. So you can tell him to give back to you, or you can explain to her that Mike is your new boyfriend. Mike and M split were together. Whoa. Drama. Not really. Pretty clear cut actually. M's out, I'm in. Huh. So that's her, that was Mike's ex-girlfriend, um, Emily. Not actually. Mm. All right, all right, let's just get up to the lodge already. It's getting tired of all this nature and junk. Uh, you guys go ahead. I'm just gonna wait here for a bit. See who else is coming. You mean Mike? What? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, you know, whoever. You know, anybody. Uh, Sam? <laughs> Holy cow. And this is still Sometimes summer? I, forget to just I know. Stop and take it all oh, in. Dude, I actually can't remember. Hmm? I want to say it's summer. Seriously, couldn't they have built the lodge, like, right where the cable car ends? Let me see. I'm going to look up when until Dante takes place. Persuasive. Dude, imagine if, he, if someone's watching this in the comment section, like, for the, for the last, I don't know, 40 minutes. I'm like, dude, it's not summer. Like pretty. <laughs> So that's her new boyfriend. He was there too, wasn't he? Yep. No. And where's the bellboy when you need one? <sighs> getting chills. The location well, wasn't. No, I mean, getting kind of creeped out. Actually, I have no idea when yeah. it takes place. It's awesome. gonna be weird. Seeing I want to say it's during summer again. though, because I want to say they just graduated. Definitely not gonna school. feel like. I don't know, if someone's watching in the comments. Ah! Jesus! <laughs> this douche. Intelligent, driven, persuasive. You guys. Michael! You really, really should have seen Him your faces right there. Dude, I almost clocked yeah. him just now. <laughs> nice one. Michael, you're a jerk. Come on. Guys, we're all friends here, right? No need for violence, just a little harmless fun. We're up in the woods, it's spooky. Come on, let's get into the spirit of things. The spirit of things? Seriously, what's wrong with you? I'm just trying to lighten the mood, Em. Don't be like that. Like what? The way you're being, you always get like She's this. a bitch. Damn, Michael, you gotta step shots off. fired. That's right. Emily and I are together now, and that's just the way it is. I'm not gonna tell you again. Do we understand each other? We passed all this. We fudge, but yeah, fine. Mike. No, no, no. No, it's totally cool. I'm just gonna head down the road, be all mature and shit by myself over here. Peace. I think you got the message. Kinda hot when you get all alpha, you know that? <laughs> oh, crap. What? Hey, could you? Take these the rest of the way. The bags? Yeah, all the bags. Uh, all the bags. Why? <laughs> I need to go find Sam. Okay. Sorry, I just, I really need to go find her. I totally forgot I needed to talk to her before we get all the way up there. This really can't wait. We're almost there. It's important, Matt, please. All right, fine. If it's so important, I guess I can pack horse it the rest of the way. But you owe me one. Excuse me? Well, then we're even, at least. I'll think about it. Just be careful. Yeah, that didn't turn out how I thought it was going to turn out the mm -hmm. first time. Thank you.
but you did threaten Mike, so that's gonna come into play later. Oh. Or you can make it come into play later. I plan to see you, though. So this is Ashley. That blonde kid we don't like, she likes him. Okay. She's academic, that? inquisitive, forthright, which just means she's honest. All right. Whoa, hello. Somebody's getting a little friendly. And not in the friend zone kind of way. They might need to check the expiration date on their big breakup. <laughs> That's such a good line. Oh! oh God. <laughs> <laughs> it's a little jump scare. Oh, yeah. Sorry there. Sorry about that, Ash. I didn't mean to scare Just you. Louise, well, Matt. I did mean to scare you, sort of scare you, but not like for real scare you. Oh my you. gosh, oh my gosh. <laughs> hey, wow. Well, man, I'm, I'm really sorry, Ash, damn. It's okay, it's fine, it's fine. What are you looking at? See anything juicy with that thing? Uh, it, Let me check it out. Does okay. she know? Um, so you can, you can lie to him, or you can tell him to take a look for himself. Yeah. She's the honest one. Um, so. Sure, uh, go I like go this. Ahead. You're playing the characters Come like out. how yeah. to the best traits. Oh, son of a bitch. And you just threatened him. Emily? So you hell, just played it. Listen, it's probably nothing. nothing you think? Well, yeah. Is it ever just nothing with him? Ever? I don't know. I... God damn it. Matt. So now you're back to um, Jess. Okay. So you can read a book or you can check your phone. And she's just listening to music. Oh, you did not just do that. Put your hands where I can see them. We've got you surrounded. Because they're together now. But who yep. am I to retaliate? What choice do I, a supple young rebel girl, have but to surrender to the strapping military guard come to take me into custody? Good thing it was just one mate right there. I, well, I don't know. When you put it like that, hey! <laughs> so you can shoot him. I also like oh, the song that plays right now. Great. It's cute. Hey, you know that? <laughs> Where are you hiding, little chicken? Oh! Ah. Hey! Oh, snap! Yeah, I really like the way they do this whole scene. <laughs> Hello! Come on! <laughs> hey, Mike! Sometimes doing nothing is the right thing. You can't to do. hide from me, Michael. I know all your tricks. Remember what I told you about the bird? Yeah. Remember that totem pole? Right there. You let it go. You completed the totem pole. Awesome. And now it gives you the option to shoot him. Wow! Oh. If you would have shot the bird, he would have been disgusted with you and not being interested as much anymore. Okay. You're going down. Gotcha. Done. Done city. So did I go down? Uh, I don't think so. <laughs> I think good. Yeah, she's super flirtatious. All right. All right. You my, my. So are we calling it my favor then? You're a worthy opponent. Miss Jessica, the Snowball Queen. Okay, that sounds vaguely dirty. My lady. Says Fedora. Ah! <laughs> oh, ho, ho. Okay. Okay, you're really gonna get it. What am I gonna get? Well, I can think of at least one thing. Yeah. But you'll have to wait until later. We should get up to the lodge. Yeah. It's so nice out here, though. Pretty breathtaking. I mean, I could stay out here for pretty much ever, provided I was hanging out with you the whole time. 
just making out? Quote, unquote. Well, I think we might freeze to death somewhere in between those quotes. Yeah. I can't remember who you're going to use now. Hey. I think that might be the end of the chapter. Yeah, it is. Hello again. And how are we feeling? Hmm? I hope that you managed to stay away from dark places since we last spoke. This time, we're going to try to understand the root of your anxiety. Now pick up that book. Turn the pages. Oh yeah, this is really fun. You'll like this you a lot. You see a set of pictures and symbols. I want you to identify which image in each set makes you the most anxious. Men worry me, women worry me. Yeah, watch out for crazy bitches. Yep. Planes scare me, crowds scare me. Crowds. And before a plane crashes into a crowd. <laughs> heights or drowning? Heights. Hate heights. Dude, but drowning is such a slow death. Nah. Snakes or rats? Rats. Really? Rats. I could care less for rats. You haven't seen them. Dude, I, in They're my old huge. job, I killed them. Really? Yeah. I hate them. Had to put rat traps in attics and then pick up the dead ones, and sometimes they'd have maggots. And I'd be like, fuck this. Okay. Oh, nice. Ooh, you didn't know what to do on that one. So you can hide a knife. So now rats or cockroaches. Cockroaches, hands down. Dude, you're going for the week of the things that literally can't. Dude, they fly sometimes, man. But snakes can literally bite the shit out of me. Ah, son. Clowns. For yeah, sure. for clowns. We can do without them. This is weird. Gore or crows. Wait, wait. I'm not scared of both of them. It's so... Did that startle you? So sorry. You're doing very well. Thank you. Don't be nervous. Okay, Try so now he's gonna give you a timer. Speed up a bit. The more you rely on your instincts, the more honest your answers will be, awesome. and the more enlightening you will find this experience. Dude, he's always doing these big eyes. Gore or needles? I don't know why they put gore to like to all this other stuff. Yeah. Gore is literally like organ and stuff. Clowns. Every time. Yeah, fuck clowns. We can just do without. We can breed them out of the gene pool. What oh, are Gore's like everywhere. Right. Well, it's because you keep choosing it. Oh. Or it puts what you choose against something else until. Okay. This is very interesting. So is Gore Thank gonna come out in the game now? For what? answering so diligently. <laughs> Cockroaches, clowns, and awful. The <laughs> sun combination sounds like a good Friday night. <laughs> Uh, well, I'm afraid, once again, we're out of time, but I promise we'll talk again very soon. All right, so I've, we'll, we're going to end this right now. Just sure. take a quick break, okay? All right. As soon as this guy's done. So right. Pause. Pause. All right, so uh, for anyone that's played Until Dawn, we got uh, your main characters. We got Mike, who starts off as a douchebag, but becomes a nice person. We got, um, what's his name, Jessica, 
his girlfriend who is really ditzy. Um, I've gotten her killed every single time I play. I'm trying not to, but I'm sorry. Um, Emily, who's a bitch. Matt, who's Emily's boyfriend. Also, the black guy. Also, the one that I think can die the most amount of times. And those two as a couple, super forgettable. Chris and Ash. Uh, Chris is uh, tries to be funny, but it's very dorky. And Ashley, she's... She seems like she's a genuine nice person, but sometimes just does the wrong thing. And then there's also uh, Sam, who is um, really awesome. I like Sam. She just, she seems like she's a normal one of the group. Um, we got the twins, which uh, died at the beginning of the game, which will always die no matter what happens. And then we also got um, the therapist. And uh, the therapist is my favorite character because um, there's certain things you can do in the game when um, you're getting chased by Sam where if you do the correct things, you get like a, almost like a secret chapter where you can kind of figure out where that guy came from. For you guys to know what I'm talking about, I like where your head's at. For you guys that don't know what I'm talking about, we're going to we're gonna get to that. But um, yeah, that's, how, that's where we're at so far and uh, let's see what uh, Junior has. All right, well. I think Matt's a little insecure and M's kind of slutty. Um, just can't forget about Mike, obviously. Um, who's Sam? Sam, like, she's the blonde girl. Okay, the, yeah. I like the, that she likes Sam. That's pretty cool. Chris, glasses, right? It's trying too hard. Um, Jessica, I think she's innocent right now. You know, she just wants to be with Mike. Mike might have something on the side with them. Shit's gonna go down. This other one, Ashley. Honest Ashley, that's what I'm gonna call her. Hey, she says how it is. That's how I'm gonna play her.